In this video, we will be going over how to subtract fractions by renaming the mixed numbers. One way to subtract mixed numbers is by using fraction strips. So fraction strips can help you subtract mixed numbers or subtract a mixed number from a whole number by using a visual model. So the first problem asks you to find the difference of 3 and 1 third and 2 and 2 thirds. So step one, model the number you are subtracting from, which is 3 and 1 third. So to model 3 and 1 third, we know there's three holes. So we're going to create three rectangles. One, two, three. And we need a third. So what we can do to, to create a third is create another rectangle and cut it into three parts. And 3 and 1 third will be represented by the purple color. So that's 3 and 1 third. I'll show you by moving it over. It's 3 and 1 third. 3 and then one part of the fourth one. What we want to do now is we want to subtract 2 and 2 thirds. But notice we cannot take away 2 thirds from the 1 third because 1 third is smaller than 2 thirds. So what should I do? If you said change a hole into its parts, you are correct. So we can use one of the holes and we're going to separate into three parts to make it into a third. So now this is one third, one third, and one third. But it's still part of three and one third. But instead of using three and one third now, we're using two holes because there's two holes. And now there's one part, two part, three part, four part. So now it'll be represented as four thirds. Notice that we changed 3 and 1 third to now 2 and 4 thirds. So now what we can do is now we can take away 2 and 2 thirds from 2 and 4 thirds, which is the same as 3 and 1 third, because 4 is now bigger than 2. In order to take away 2 and 2 thirds, now what we want to do is we want to remove 2 holes, and we're going to remove 2 thirds, so that means 1 part, one part, so that's two parts. So now we're left with two parts, which is two over three, because there's three parts in a whole, so my answer is two thirds. And when we subtract it mathematically, now we can do four thirds minus two thirds. Remember, we keep the denominator, but we subtract the numerator, so four minus two is two, and two minus two is zero, so the answer is two thirds, and it checks out. Now the next problem is find the difference of 2 and 1 and 1 fourth. So if you want to press pause and try the problem first, you can press pause now and then play the video once you're done solving the problem. So to find the difference of 2 and 1 and 1 fourth, what you can do is you can also model using a fraction strip. So to model a fraction strip, we know that we are starting with 2 because we're taking 1 and 1 fourth away from 2. So we'll make two boxes. one. 2. Now the problem asks you to take away 1 and 1 fourth, but notice there are no parts. These are all holes. How can you take away 1 and 1 fourth from the 2? So if you said separate one of the holes into four parts, you are correct. So instead of using two holes, we're going to change one of the holes into four parts because the denominator is 4. So separate into four parts. 1, 2, 3. Instead of using two holes, what we're using now is 1 and 4 over 4. So now we can take away 1 and 1 fourth because there are parts that we could take away from. So to take away 1 and 1 fourth, now what we can do is we could get rid of one hole and we could get rid of a fourth. So we are left with three small parts and because there's four parts in a whole, the answer is 3 over 4. And if you subtract this mathematically, notice that the top number has a numerator that's bigger than the second number, which is 1. So 4 minus 1 is 3. We keep the denominator, which is 4. 1 minus 1 is 0. So the answer is 3 fourths. So we can subtract and rename the fractions by using fraction models or by using the actual fractions and changing the mixed numbers by breaking the whole into smaller parts. In our example, we represented 2 as 1 and 4 fourths. After watching this video, you should be able to know how to change or rename mixed numbers to subtract fractions, and you should also be able to subtract mixed numbers.